guys and welcome back to my YouTube channel and in this video I'm going to be making some hold on zombie biscuit cookies so it's a mix and then we add some stuff to it and then we decorate and I've got a really small idea and also in my Halloween costume so I'm supposed to be Chucky We've like some like fake blood and dirt and then the oath and then like dungarees and like the scars. And the reason I'm dressed up is because I do it at my doctor's school. So let's get started. But first I'm gonna wash my hands. So first of all we need to cut out the template. So I've got so I've got a bowl, the mix that came with it, the colouring that came with it, I've got the cutout stencil and some butter that needed to be softened so I'll just let that cool down from being in the fridge and now it's really good. So I just got to add everything, everything into the mixing bowl. I'm going to add the mix first. And then I've got to add Five grams of softened butter. Sorry. So we're just going to add in 65 grams of softened butter. So I've added the butter in, and we're now going to add in 15 milliliters of water. So 15. Anyway, add in 15 millilitres of water. Oh wait, I just found a much better way to do it. One tablespoon of water. So, a tablespoon, a tablespoon. Um, oh, wait. Right, one tablespoon of water. And we're now going to whisk these together, together with a whisk. So, so I'm now going to place it into the fridge just to let it like uh, firm up a bit because I've melted some of the butter, well not like, I kind of melted the butter and it's just a bit greasy so I'm just going to pop it in the fridge and if that's the same case with you, just pop it in the fridge and it will firm up and it will be good. So I've got a place all floured out, a place all floured out and I'm going to grab my dough and I'm just going to place it on there. And I'm going to roll it out with a rolling pin. I'm just going to put some flour on top of there and some flour on the rolling pin so that it doesn't stick to the rolling pin as well. Oh, stupid sleeves. So we're now just going to roll it out until it gets to about five millimetres um, thick. Dun, 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 dun. Dun, dun, dun. I swear this year for Halloween I had no clue what I was going to wear so I had to do something really last really last minute because like all the past years I've really known what I wanted to be but for this one I actually had no clue what I was going to be why is it breaking off So now it looks 
like a good, thick, good, it's like a good thickness. Let's get to do that. And we're now going to grab our stencil. Just gonna, oh, she's so uneven. And we're just going to pop it on in one of the corners. And we're then going to cut around the little guy with a knife. Let's see how this works out. Shall we? So let's just do that. So I've got all of them here and I'm just going to put them, not this, this is just excess, and I'm going to put them onto um, a baking tray with some parchment paper on it. So they are on the tray for this one, I've done like a little experiment to see what will happen. And we're now going to put them in the oven, which you need to set. She needs to set to 160 degrees fan or 180 degrees. And we're going to put them in for 20 to 25 minutes. So I've got the cookies on the cooling rack and they're all cooled down. And so I'm going to start decorating them. So they are all done and they taste really good and i will see you in the next video